today I think I'll show you another pocket technique and just to review that a pocket technique is uh, really just a technique that I develop on the fly as I go along I look at an image and and I say gee what can I do with it so just follow along with me as I develop this pocket technique here for this image and in this image I think I'm going to use uh, some uh, lighting filters so um, Let's see, the first thing I'm going to do is create uh, a new layer, Control J. And I'm going to go up to Filter, Render, Lighting Effects. And let's see, let's bring in this. Uh, and for this, I'm going to use the Omni. Uh, you got Directional, you got Spotlight, and we got Omni. I'm going to use Omni. And I'm going to adjust this. Uh, I don't know, right behind the wagon somewhere. Uh, let's see, maybe that's a little too bright. Here, bring it down just a little hair. And let's see, I can play with the, the shiny matte. I kind of like the matte. It's kind of more, a little more subtle. Then I got metallic and, and uh, plastic. And let's see, mess around with the exposure. That looks good right there. And I'm going to click OK. You'll see what that looks like. All right. That doesn't look too bad. Um, this thing I'm going to do is I'm going to create a curves adjustment layer. So I'm going to go into my adjustment layers. I'm going to bring up curves. And the first thing I think I'll do is the typical S curve. Uh, S curve gives me a little more contrast, and uh, let me just see what I got over on this side. Adjust it. Okay, this is the this is my curves uh, adjustment layer, and I'll click over. No, you know what? Let's do something a little different here. I'm going to go into the red channel and I'm going to bring bring the red channel up a little bit here. Yeah, there we go. I'm going to bring the red channel. Then I'm going to go into the the blue yellow channel and bring the yellows up a little bit here. There we go. That looks good, and I'll take that. Okay, you know what I think I'll do now? I think I'll duplicate this layer, and I'm going to change its blending mode to multiply. And I need to reduce the opacity on this. Yeah, there we go. You know what? I'm going to duplicate it one more time. And this time I'm going to change its blending mode to soft light. So let's see what we got here. That don't look too bad. You know, just a little quick uh, pick me up for, for an image that uh, was just hanging around on my hard drive. Not doing nothing. So let's see what we got. We started out with this and we wound up with that. And just uh, an added effect, a pocket technique, and you can use it and put it away, you know, pull it out for a rainy day, you feel like playing around with an image, go ahead and try this one. Thank you.